Right, so here we are then. There's the three rod and the two rod, and I've managed to grab James again for five minutes. So, James, talk me through the extractor rod pods. Okay, yeah. So the new extractor rod pods are available in the two rod version and three rod version. Now, the design of these is a little bit different. Uh, what we've utilized is a similar system to our split sticks, um, where you've separated the top of the bank stick and the bottom point of the bank stick here. So these pods actually utilize uh, normal bus bars, uh, which connects through to, to the main bar of the pod. Now, what we spent our time on is actually getting a little swivel angle adapter, um, which gives the pod really nice stability uh, and allows you quite a, a, a lot of different setups. So, for example, if I just uh, if I just take this one off there, you can see it's like a drop-in fitting. And what you've got is um, the ability to just remove the leg. I will do it on this one. And you've got different angle settings depending on whether that's upwards or whether it's downwards. So it enables you to, ang to change the angle of the legs. And it also enables you to tighten these right up. So I see a lot of people struggling with locking collars and you just tease them up and then use that to tighten them up fully and you get the correct angle there. Now, the bar just drops in and just locates there with an anti-twist. Can you just take that one out again, James, and show us again? So I'll just yeah, they just like drop in. So. Yeah. so that's neat, very neat. And that just locks up tight. Yeah. That's perfect. So what you can also do is remove remove the side legs on this and actually utilize this pod. Um, say if you're fishing on a wooden platform and you can actually, you've got uh, the ability to, to add screw fittings there and you've got the collars here that keeps it nice and stable. Right, so that's, so that's great. That's, if, that's totally locked to that. Yeah. That's perfect again, yeah. And again, that's just the two rod ones there. You've got the slightly shorter um, uprights for your bite alarms and your rubber back vest go on Now, you, you skipped over it pretty quickly, but you were saying about these are, basically, these are from the, the split the sticks. sticks. yeah. So, yeah, we do. so it, this this basically complements the stands system with well, all the sticks, etc. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. So you get a lot of guys that really like to um, have like a base bar type setup. So again, if you're in somewhere where you want to put the bank sticks down into the ground, you can actually do that quite easily. Okay. So again, you so can tighten really up the collars. Just, it really is that quick. Yeah, that yeah. quick. And then you can pop that in the ground uh, and you've got something that's, um, you know, like a, has the, the buzz bar along the floor there, you know, perfect. which gets you perfect alignment. So we've actually got a, an addition. So we're going to start to sell these products next year, which are we've called buzz points. Yeah. Now these are just little uh, triangular shaped points that you can add on to any sort of goalpost type buzz bar. And what that will do is it will help prevent twist when you're using like a base bar setup. Um, also, you can use them as uh, pod feet as well, as you can see here, and it'll just pop onto uneven ground and just prevents anything from twisting, moving around. But uh, we've had some great feedback on these because they're actually really stable, nice and light, nice and compact, and uh, ultimately adaptable.